Former Mayor's Council of Guam Executive Director Angel Sablon coming out of retirement to head the Department of Parks and Recreation. I'm still young in the prime of my life. <laughs> At 68 years old. Sablon was hoping to go into full retirement when he gave his 30-day notice to the council last month. His final day was on December 1st. But uh, when I got a call and says, are you still willing to serve the people of Guam? The public service blood in me couldn't say no. He since accepted Governor Lulian Guerrero's appointment as a new director for DPR and is set to assume his position on December 18th. I accepted the offer because I, I think I can, there's still some good in me that I can, can provide the people of Guam and, and do some good for the Department of Parks and Recreation. Sablon is no stranger to public service or Parks and Rec. He shares he was DPR's deputy director in 1985. So I kind of know what parks and recreation needed then, I'm sure it's not the same thing now. It's probably more. And his 15-year tenure serving the mayor's council will guide him in his plans for a new and better parks and rec. It's because I can also work with them. They know me, I know them. And there's a lot of things in all of it. They all have parks, they all have recreational facilities. And so it makes just as much sense that I engage with them and make sure that our parks are uh, upgraded, our rec recreational facilities are renovated and upgraded, especially for our youth. His priorities include working with village mayors, the Guam Visitors Bureau, and the legislature to make sure public pools and parks are up to par. But yes, the pool is one of them. Uh, it's been a long time coming, and we need to get it going. I don't want it to be another Simon Sanchez, of which I'm also involved with of it not being built. Everything says, oh, we're going to go, we're going to, we're going to. No more we're going to. Let's do it and build it. I mean, the parks, one of the major complaints of our tourists is that the parks are dirty, the restrooms are not open. We've got to change that image. And making sure the recreation part doesn't get forgotten, especially for our youth. Each of these villages have a community center, and they can also be used in the evenings, during the days, during the weekends. I still remember the days when we had ping pong at uh, the recruit. I mean, at the villages, we had basketball, we had um, you know chess tournaments, things like that. Uh, I th I think that we can still bring that back, and and make like I said. Uh, our, our kids have something to do instead of just roaming the streets. He'll be replacing acting director Warren Pelletier, who will be the deputy director. Meantime, he says the mayor's council executive director position remains vacant for at least a few more weeks as they narrow down applicants. Until then... That I'll come in and out and, and still help wherever I can to, uh, you know, make sure that everything doesn't stop because I'm gone. I'm going to make sure that things still go on, uh, even if I have to guide them through it. Mitsuki Hariyama, KUAM News.